Hi Union Church family, Dave Ruskus coming to you from Dallas, Texas, and I have the great honor of serving on the Union Church Advisory Board. I'm so excited for you today. I wish that I could be with you in person. What a huge day as we celebrate together the installation of two pastors. And when I think about today, and I've been praying for you today, these are the words that come to mind. These are Paul's words to the church at Philippi from Philippians chapter one. Let me read them for you. I thank my God in all my remembrance of you, always in every prayer of mine for you all, making my prayer with joy because of your partnership in the gospel from the first day until now. And I'm sure of this, that he who began a good work in you will bring it to completion at the day of Jesus Christ. Union Church, God is doing something great in Livingston County, in you and through you. When we see families come together to plant the church, families like the Ezekiel family and that Rodriguez family and many of the families that have joined in, we acknowledge God is at work. When we see two pastors called into uh, the ministry of eldership, we see that God is at work. And so today we wanna to celebrate the fact that God is at work, but here's the truth from this passage. If God is at work starting something, He's going to be faithful to complete it. So how do we respond today? What, what, what sort of heart should we have as we, as we celebrate all that God is doing? Two things come out of this passage. First, we have thankful hearts. My heart is overflowing with thankfulness today as I think about all that God is doing, all that he will do in Livingston County and beyond through Union Church. The other thing we feel is just a great sense of joy. So I want to invite you to be thankful today. Rejoice today. God is doing something incredible, something incredible for, for your good and the good of people living in Livingston County and beyond, and he's also doing great things for his glory, and you get to be a part of it. So wish I could join you in person, but I'm celebrating with you in spirit today. God bless you. Hey, Union Church, I wanted to take just a second to introduce myself and encourage you. My name's Josh Patterson. I serve as a pastor on staff here at a church called the Village Church down in Dallas, Texas, and I also have the privilege of serving on the advisory board to your church, Union Church. And uh, there's so much excitement, so much movement, so much to celebrate uh, what the Lord is doing in and through and among you. And this day, which is a day that I regret that I couldn't be a part of, is a day where you, we, in some sense, you are installing Ethan and Kyle as pastors. And so I've had the opportunity and the privilege to walk with these brothers and encourage them and hear from them, pray for them, hear their hearts in and around pastoral ministry, interview them around these things. And today's a big day. Uh, it is a milestone day for your church. And so just want to encourage you, the Lord's at work, remain faithful, stay tethered to him and celebrate. Celebrate all that he's doing as you gather on this good day to rejoice. Bless you, praying for you, excited for you. Hey, Union Church, uh, Matt Chandler here, uh, usually in Dallas, but right now in Big Bend National Forest. Uh, listen, excited of all God's doing there in Brighton, and I'm more excited about what's to come for you. Just fully confident that there, from Brighton to the ends of the earth, you're going to be faithful to Jesus, and you're going to be a part of him pushing back darkness and establishing light. Praying for you guys. God bless you. Hey, Union Church, my name is Adam Flint. I'm one of the pastors at Church of 1122 in Jacksonville, Florida. What an honor and a privilege it is to partner with you guys. And this is an exciting day because you all are installing uh, Ethan and Kyle as your pastors today. What a huge step. We talk around our church that churches aren't given to pastors, pastors are given to churches, and you all are getting to incredible pastors. And so, we are thrilled to partner with you guys, excited for what God is doing. Can't wait to see what he's doing in and through you in the future. Hello, Union Church. I bring you greetings from the Summit Church just outside of the St. Louis area. And we are so encouraged and excited about what's happening up there for you today. I'm Brian Agavino, I'm the lead pastor here, and we have been praying for you guys for a long, long time. And we wanna celebrate with you and how the gospel story is flourishing. I would encourage you guys, as you continue to see and watch and hear all the amazing things that the gospel is doing in your midst, remember, sometimes you'll have days like today where you can celebrate and look back and testify to God's goodness 
Some days there will be those days where you will wonder, is God working and what's happening? And let me encourage you and remind you that he always is, that God is always in work, in plenty and in struggle. And know that even though we're many, many miles away, that there's a group of brothers and sisters in Christ who are praying for you and encouraged that the gospel is taking root in your town. And our hope and prayer is that it will grow and flourish and more and more people will come to know the goodness of Jesus Christ. We're excited for you guys. We're so encouraged to partner with you guys in what is happening there. And we look forward to hearing more about how God is being faithful in and through you. God bless. Hey, what's up, Union Church? We are so excited for you. We're Eric and Erica Giso, the pastors of Alive Family Church, another local church here in Livingston County, partnering for the kingdom with you guys. Man, we celebrate what a special day you guys are celebrating today. Yes. We want you to know we're cheering you on and we've been praying for you guys. We're so excited to be partnered together as new church plants in the area, taking over kingdom for territory for the kingdom. And so we just wanted to shout out and say we celebrate you guys and we're so excited for what God is doing through you all. So cool. And what, what an awesome special day uh, it is as Pastor Kyle and Pastor Ethan are officially installed. We're celebrating with you guys. You guys are blessed with some amazing leaders and hearts for the Lord and the kingdom. And so we're so excited to partner with you guys and to support you guys along your journey. We're cheering you on. So go God, go Union Church. We're excited for the days ahead. Good morning, Union Church. We are Jim and Lisa Samra, and we minister at Calvary Church in Grand Rapids, Michigan. And we're super excited to partner with Union Church as you expand God's kingdom in Brighton, Michigan. Ethan and Kyle, I just wanna say a word of encouragement to you. Second Samuel 23 says uh, that when leaders lead in the fear of the Lord, it is like sunshine on a cloudless morning. So be light to your people and be light in the community in which God's placed you. And to the congregation, we want to encourage you from Hebrews 13, where it says to submit to your leaders and to encourage them because they keep watch over you. To pray for them, to encourage them, to serve alongside them, because Hebrews tells us that it will be a blessing to you. We're excited uh, for this opportunity for you as a church to officially install Kyle and Ethan as your leaders. May God continue to bless you. Hey guys, I'm Joe from 242. And I'm Michelle. And Ethan and Kyle, we are so excited. We're excited for what you guys do here in this community and really wanted to say hello today. And we're so proud to have you guys here part of Livingston County and really go from here to wherever else God has sent you guys. We are so excited for what is ahead as partners in God's kingdom. All right guys, have a great weekend and we hope to see you very soon. What is up, Union Church? My name is Kaoni Hughes, and uh, I'm a pastor in Hudsonville, Michigan at Grace Community Church. Um, and just as a word of encouragement, you know, I think it's interesting how if you look at Timothy and Titus and these church planters and how the Apostle Paul encourages them, um, you know, the language is constant to, to not grow slack, to not grow weary in doing good, to fan the flame of faith, to utilize your gifts, um, to not neglect that, to keep a close eye on yourself and on your doctrine, um, all of these exhortations and encouragements I would offer to you as well, knowing that every believer needs to be reminded um, to not grow weary in doing good. Um, and every believer needs to be reminded uh, to spur one another on. And uh, so I guess in that vein, I would say, keep on keeping on. Um, don't grow weary. Hey, Union Church, this is Mike Bartlett from over at Redemption City Church in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Uh, though I couldn't be there in person today, I just wanted to send greetings from our church to yours. We are so excited to see what God is doing on the other side of the state. Uh, excited to see new pastors being installed uh, today and just to see the continued growth happening over there. It's been also great to send our guy Sebastian over there to lead worship with you. And so we're just excited for our partnership in the gospel to see what God is doing here in the state of Michigan. Your church is proof that Jesus is still building his church and that the gates of hell will not prevail against it. You guys got planted in the middle of a global pandemic and yet Jesus is still building his church and moving that mission forward. And we just want to celebrate with you guys today. 
What's happening, Union Church? My name is Noel Hakenen, and I'm one of the pastors at Riverview Church up in Lansing. And I really wish that I could be there with you in person today, but I can't uh, because I'm in Brazil. So I'm sending you this message from my hotel room. And I just want to tell you how thankful we as a church family are for you guys for your faithful proclamation of the gospel of Jesus in Livingston County. It has been a great joy of ours to get to know the Ezekians, and we are praying for your church. In fact, I want to read to you a prayer that we have been praying for you out of Ephesians 1, where it says this, I pray that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the glorious Father, would give you the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of him. So we are praying that as you grow in your knowledge, of Jesus, that the Spirit would give you all wisdom and revelation that you need to continue to do the faithful work that you're doing down there in Livingston County. God bless you. We love you. Hey, Union Church. My name is Ryan Kimmel. I'm the lead pastor at Peace Church. We're over in West Michigan. We're about a half an hour south of Grand Rapids. And I want to let you know that we have been praying for you even before you became a church. As many of you probably know, Pastor Ethan and Pastor Kyle, they were at Peace Church for a long time, got to serve with those guys for many years. I am so excited for our church to be partnering with your church, to be praying for you, to see the kingdom flourish, to see God do great things in this world. I just want to uh, take a moment and, and send you this word of blessing and encouragement. Your name as a church, Union, this whole idea of unity and union, isn't that missing in this world? And so Union Church, Please, would you be a great shining example of being united to Christ and united to each other? And please know that even in a little town in West Michigan, you've got a lot of people praying for you. We're praying for you. Can't wait to see what God continues to do in and through you as a church. Blessings. Hey, Union Church, Ethan and Kyle, congratulations on installation today. We are so excited to see what God is doing in the church and we pray that you would run the race faithfully, that you would finish it strong and hard, testifying to the gospel of Jesus Christ. Blessings to you. We're praying for you every day. Hi, Kyle. Hi, Ethan. It's Ben. God bless you on the leading of God's church there in Brighton. I just wanted to remind you that we must first be worshipers before we can be workers. And I want to encourage you in your worship and in your work for God there. Uh, blessings to you. See you later. Congratulations, Kyle and Ethan. I'm so excited for you. Hey, Kyle. Congratulations on getting installed today. I've installed hundreds of things, but never a pastor. So you have that going for you. The only thing that could make this day any better for you is if you could be celebrating with this spectacular church staff NCAA March Madness Tournament Trophy. But you can't because you came in second. Do you remember who came in first? Oh, yeah, it was me. Anyway, good luck. See you soon. Whatever. Congratulations, Kyle and Ethan. We're so excited for you. Kyle and Ashley, we miss you like crazy. Best wishes to everybody in Brighton. We love you guys. Congratulations, Kyle. I miss having you in the office slash closet next door. Blessings to you and Ashley and Judah and Camper and your church family in Brighton. Congratulations, Kyle and Ethan. This is a huge day. Congratulations Union Church uh, from Sunshine Community Church. We're so glad to partner with you guys. We were honored to play a part in Kyle's preparation for this journey. And you need to know that we're praying for you and rooting for you. Church planting is an amazing adventure and you guys get to go on this journey with two amazing pastors. And we're very thankful to God for that. Hello Union Church, this is Tyler Powell, Church Planting Director at the Village Church in Flower Mound, Texas. I had the honor to serve alongside Ethan and Dana as they were here for our church planting residency. I'm very excited about this day as you get to install Pastor Ethan and Pastor Kyle. Thankful for the work you guys are all doing and reaching your community for the gospel. And may God's name be glorified and his kingdom grow in your area, in your community, in your state and beyond. Blessings to you all.